Hi, I'm Jennifer Kara, scientist with the Nature Conservancy, and these are my notes from the field. Coho salmon are a critical part of California's North Coast ecosystem. For centuries, hundreds of thousands would come back to spawn across our state in rivers like the Garcia and the Navarro. But because of overfishing and harmful land and water management practices, they now number in the low thousands, and coho on much of the North Coast are endangered. But we have an opportunity to bring this iconic species back from the brink of extinction. We partnered with the National Marine Fisheries Service and California Department of Fish and Wildlife and others to launch a conservation rearing program for coho in the Garcia River. What is conservation rearing? It's a dating service for salmon. Sadly, in most years, fewer than 100 fish, and in some years, less than 10 adult coho survive to spawn in the Garcia River, which makes it really hard to find a mate, especially one who isn't a sibling or a cousin. This can lead to inbreeding, which reduces fitness and survival in their offspring, and is likely a really important factor limiting their recovery. That's where we come in. Together with our partners, we captured some of the last baby coho in the Garcia and raised them at the Warm Springs Fish Hatchery. We also captured some baby coho from the Navarro River next door to make sure we had enough fish who weren't closely related. Genetic samples were taken from each fish and their DNA was sequenced. This information allowed us to do some matchmaking, matching the most distantly related males and females to maximize genetic diversity in their offspring. We captured our first baby coho in 2018, each weighing an ounce or two. By December of 2020, our first generation of babies were all grown up, with some weighing in at over 10 pounds. They were ready to be returned to the river to do what they would do naturally in December, swim upriver and meet. The fish were loaded up in tanker trucks in small groups with their optimal genetic partners and driven back to the river. Today, I'm on the Garcia River, and we're about to release some adult coho salmon. The hatchery truck should be here any minute, and once the hatchery truck arrives, we'll all get suited up and masked up and get ready to release the fish to the river. Here comes the coho express. Now it's time to release the fish. Here's one of the big females we just released. She's hanging out, getting her wits about her. She's been through a lot to get here today. She's a beauty. They'll hang out for a few minutes and then take off. Looks like she's getting ready to take off right now. There she goes. She's heading downstream to find some friends. Altogether, we released 120 fish in the Garcia and 80 in the Navarro and we'll do the same each year for the next several years to help boost population numbers and prevent extinction. Since this footage was taken, surveyors have already observed our fish building nests and laying eggs upstream of where we released them. So our matchmaking appears to be going to plan. Find out more at nature.org backslash California.